charts with that brand new single reminding me featuring Vanessa Hudgens it's got over 5 million views and 10 million streams plus a brand new album dropping tomorrow please welcome Canada's own Sean Hook we are hot my friend yet Thank again you. So good to see you. Good to see you as well. Congrats. No big deal. Vanessa Hudgens, super hot again. We just saw her co-hosting uh, with the, the Billboards, Billboard Awards, right? Yeah. She did a great job. Yeah. And now, how did this collaboration come together for the track? Did you have her in mind when writing it? Well, when writing it, I, I wrote it for myself, and I was thinking this is this is a strong single. But after listening to it, I wanted to have a collaboration on the, on the EP, and I felt this song was a great song for a duet. And Vanessa and I have a bunch of mutual friends in Los Angeles, and we reached, I reached out to one of them, and we met for coffee, and she loved the song, and now, now it's out. And can I say the chemistry was there, because the song is gorgeous, as is the video. You shot this in L.A., Yes. and it's an iconic home that's been used for film sets, right? Yeah, so like yeah the, Big Lebowski. the Big Lebowski was shot in it. Uh, Maroon 5 tried to shoot a music video there, but they didn't get the permit. Oh, <laughs> my director, oh, Sean did. <laughs> our director, thank you, Aya Tanamira, if she's watching, uh, oh. she went around with chocolates and flowers and gave them to the neighbors <laughs> and was like, we really need this. This location please it works and we got it so what was it like when you actually got to work together on set and create the chemistry that a video like this needs it was cool but it, you know at first the first scene we shot together was actually the bedroom scene and we're both in our underwear I'm like hi Vanessa I'm Sean she's like hi <laughs> and Vanessa like kept blinking to like get she has like she was had like this nervous thing and she's like and she, I kept laughing every time she blinked I'm like yeah. what is going on right now but eventually we we got through the awkwardness and we committed to the roles and, and we shot a great video. You had to break the ice real quick. They didn't <laughs> yeah. start you guys off in separates. It's like, here you here go. It was, it's a really gorgeous video. So when you, you see the traction and that so many people are clicking to see it and watch it and get hooked on it, yeah. is, that's got to feel rewarding to see that it sticks. For sure. I, I mean, the song I wrote probably a year ago now. And, you know, when you're in the studio, you, you can hope for, for something to do so well yeah. and to actually see it happening is it's it's a good affirmation and just excited. And of course tomorrow the EP drops. Yeah, I know. Talk to us about it and what can we expect? I know there's a variety you wanted to show different sides of yourself. Yeah, yeah. The the title is called my the EP is called My Side of Your Story. And there are four songs out of about eighty songs that I wrote in the last year. Wow. And I got to collaborate with some great writers like Ryan Tedder from One Republic, or Amar Malik, Jason Evigan, Jay Cash, all these incredible producers and songwriters and it's really Really, probably the best quality record that I've put out. Hold on, you wrote 80. What are you going to do with the other 76? <laughs> They're coming out. Okay. Yeah, I'm planning to release more, and uh, there's been other artists in, into some of the songs I've written, so I might let some go. But uh, yeah, there's a lot more music to come this year. And what about touring? Everybody wants to see you. Yes, in the works, in the works for the fall. Uh, but for now, I'm just doing some one-off shows, uh, and we'll see where we go from there. I know you spent a lot of time out west, so your hometown. Shout out to everybody watching yes. from BC. People Shout get up super BC. early and watch our show. Believe it or Amazing. not. Amazing. Yeah, from the Amazing. west coast. So, what does it feel like when you get to go back home? Because I know LA is the mecca for all things music, and you kind of have to be there to yeah. do what you yeah. do. But what is it like when you do go back home and you perform in front of the people who knew you when you were starting out? Yeah, it's incredible. I just had a, a show back in. My hometown and uh, just in Trail, BC, and it was it was overwhelming, but so amazing. I sold out the show in a week. Good for you. And it's nice just to get back to where it all started. Yeah. And uh, I miss everybody at home. And you're so Canadian because you remain so humble. So continue <laughs> all good things. Thank you okay? so much. For more information, everybody, pick it up. It's called My Side of Your Story. As you mentioned, drops tomorrow. And follow Sean at Sean Hook right now. Over to Mel.